My name is Mark Williams and I am a business reporter with the Columbus Dispatch. Uh, this is a story that we've been tracking for a few weeks now and it's truly going to be one of the biggest things uh, to hit uh, Greater Columbus and something that we're going to have to be watching very closely for at least a decade. Um, but the big news of the day is what we've always been suspecting here is that Intel is going to invest $20 billion into a Licking County site um, that will become uh, the, the state's biggest economic development project in, in its history. Um, this is this is to our generation what Honda was to the generation of folks who lived in the who grew up in the 70s and the 80s. This is that kind of transformational kinds of thing that will that will truly change everything that we have going on. The the initially. What we know is that um, Intel is going to employ 3,000 workers. The total investment, like I said, is $20 billion. There's going to be 7,000 construction jobs, and that is potentially just the start. Intel has laid out what it believes it will become the one of the largest, if not the largest, semiconductor operations on the planet. And that is just something we have struggled as a group, as a team of, of people at the dispatch. We have struggled to trying to put our arms around what that is like. This is a massive size. I mean, think of think of uh, the campus of Ohio State times two as to the site of what we're looking at. Um, we all know about the the plans that in, that uh, New Albany has to um, to annex this land from from Jersey Township in Licking County. So basically, what we're what we're seeing now already is that Intel is going to take a chunk of this land to get started and with the potential investment that this thing could over time end up being a total of eight chip factories um, and as much of a of hundred billion dollars investment over the next decade. Um, we expect construction to start later this year um, and that production will come online in the, the back half of 2025 and these will be chips that will be used in, in everything that um, is so so critically important when we talk about this stuff. Um, anything from autos to um, appliances to cell phones to computers to industrial equipment to everything. And Intel's going to make this stuff for themselves. They're going to make it for customers. And this is how critically important all this becomes.